Hi, my lovely people. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Now, we're going to jump right on into this one, honey, because I've seen some over there on the My Jazzy Life channel that really got me to wondering what's going on. It's like, ooh, the nerve of this girl. Okay, so we're going to have to do a little breakdown, right, for uh, the Jasmine subscribers over there. And I know y'all like, girl, what you talking about? So let's go. All right. When Jasmine goes live yesterday, I was watching it and it was a bunch of BS, but we'll get into that in a minute. It was the fact that I went back today to try and go and watch it. And um, I've seen this comment. So let's get into this real quick. OK, so some loony tuny right says, if you truly support jazz, please report every reactor video YouTube recommends and use it for bully harmful content. It costs us nothing. It breaks my heart seeing the amount of uncalled negativity. All right. So what made this, you know, stand out even more was that obviously Jasmine, she pinned it. Okay. So she wants whoever is watching to go out and report reactors channels. This is something she wants to advertise. Now, when I see this, I'm like, okay, whoever this person is has lost their ever loving mind. So I'm really, really hoping that it is Jasmine under a troll account. Maybe uh, Mama Dukes under a troll account, or let's just hope maybe one of her mods that are totally brainwashed is one of them, right? Because for someone to just be watching her literally to come up with something like this, well, let me just tell you something, whoever, what does it say? Only one Sosa. Let me tell you something, only one Sosa. Get your fingers together and report as much as you want to, okay? Because something here on this internet and in life and in the constitution is freedom of speech. So we can say whatever we want to say. If you're a you know person that's a little seasoned like me, we know to say alleged. We know to use disclaimers. We know to do everything. Also, once you try to say that someone has bullied or did anything else, girl, if they were to try and take the channel and we were to submit a, you know, because they can't just take it without submitting, you know, something that we get to fight back. Let's just put it that way. You can submit a claim and you can fight it back. And I'm going to tell you something. There's a lot of evidence out here that can be used when we go to, you know, create that email to say, hey, we ain't just blowing smoke out of our butts, right? There's a lot of things we can use on Jasmine. I mean, honey, if you didn't realize, there's a whole channel called My Shabby Life that can be used against Jasmine and show that um, what we're talking about is not made up. It was caught on camera. We can go and take the clips of her children saying, okay, Chris hit you. Not once, not twice, but numerous times they have said it. And then her child even saying, but I rescued her. So therefore, Jasmine knows what her children says. She knows what she puts out as content. Why don't you tell Jasmine that when she's trying to be the master editor to keep everything, um, you know, off screen so that we have nothing to talk about? Also, why don't you go over and tell Jasmine to not go live anymore? Because it seems like every time she goes live, her life falls apart right on camera. If your children are telling the truth on you, then what? I mean, I guess her subscribers are going to say that they, you know, don't watch reactors or they didn't hear the kids say it or they just think that we, uh, you know, got here and played Ava and Amaya and we were all talking like them and we were in the live. I mean, what the hell? There's nothing to make up because this girl gives people enough content in their own right. There are some other things that you should be worried about other than reactors. Like, take a look right here. Why don't you go over there and ask Jasmine why she was on live last night or yesterday, why she has so much junk under her couch. She had food and stickers and nasty stuff attached to the side of the couch and then tried to play it off when she turned the camera by mistake to the couch. Talking about, look at all these toys under here. Girl, there's not enough space under your couch to have toys under there. You got some crumbs, you got some gnats, you got some rats, you got some roaches and everything else. I don't know what's under there. Maybe all those snacks that you forced down Legend's throat to keep him to be quiet, he's tucking under there, but there ain't no toys. We don't see no Barbie doll heads hanging from under there. We don't see no trucks. We don't see no blocks. All you see is crumbs to hell under there. Also, if you, <laughs> Jasmine, if you want to play dumb, we know you keep a rug down there. What happened to your rug? Oh, I'm going to take a wild guess. It's dirty as hell. Legendary is walking around and he's dropping all those little Cheetos, fruit snacks and everything else that you're giving him. And they're going under your couch because you won't clean under there. Or the numerous times that you accidentally caught the kid's room in the background and it looked like a terror. I mean, y'all want to say go report reactors. 
why don't you go and send Jasmine an email and maybe tell her how to clean, how to clean her house, how to clean her ass, how to clean her life up. I mean, she's sitting on here and she's sweating to hell and she don't even come in the house and wash her face or nothing. Then y'all want to sit here on live and tell her that her skin is glowing and that she's looking great and she's doing a great job working out. Like, come on, you need to wake up and smell the roses because her roses really do smell like boo, boo, boo. Okay. Like how I'm just at this point, I'm really, really disgusted by how people want to say it's all the negativities that reactors bring. Um, honey, if you sit there and you watch Jasmine and you just don't feel negative by watching her and you want to sit there and believe that Chris works 24 hours a day without a break. I mean, ain't that against OSHA guidelines? If you want to sit there and believe that these kids are happy and these kids are being fed and these kids are getting the best care, then I don't know what's wrong with you. There are too many things going on in this household from too many different people, from all different kinds of outside sources, from her ex-friends to her new friends to everything. And then you even get to hear it out the kid's own mouth. But y'all still have subscribers over there that are acting as though they are brainwashed by the BS that is coming out of her mouth. If Jasmine was not so messy and would tell her own business, would make up fairy tales, and then if the kids wouldn't tell on her, then we would have absolutely nothing to talk about. There is other things that these people should be worried about. And the number one thing that they should be worried about when they're watching Jasmine is those kids. That live yesterday was a hot mess. She started off walking and as soon as they got in that house, baby, the chaos bust loose. It's so much yelling. It's so much screaming. It's so much, I don't know what's going on. These kids are getting on my nerves. I might be pregnant. I'm depressed. I got to call Teladoc. My man's at work. Ooh, let me give legendary food to be quiet. I mean, it is so much and so chaotic anymore that even if she does go live, there's nothing that you can watch. The kids are screaming and hollering. And while they're screaming and hollering, if you slow the video down, they actually telling her business. So don't worry about reporting no reactor, boo-boo, because there, like I said, there's things that people can do to fight those things. So even if you advertise it, Jasmine, because we know you your own troll and you sit over and type things when you think people aren't looking, honey, it ain't going to work. Girl, you need to go work on yourself, honey. You need to go figure out what's going on. You need to go get your mop and broom and start cleaning because, you know, sometimes stress can manifest in different areas. Girl, let the stress manifest and getting up and cleaning up. You don't need to go for a walk. You need to have a family chore day and everybody gets the needs to scrub and dub the house, their life, their mental and get rid of the bad juju. One, you just light and sage. Did that shit not work? I mean, did you get the wrong kind? Was you burning something else? I mean, y'all. I am so freaking confused how these people still support this clown. I don't get it. But maybe, you know, maybe some people just don't have a brain or they only have a half a brain like Jasmine. Ooh, I can't wait to see what y'all got to say about this one. I don't know if y'all was catching them comments, but the comment section over there under her live is on fire. Go check it out before she starts deleting things, okay? Because some of them are funny and you will be like, what is going on? So I'm going to see y'all in the comments and don't forget to go check out those comments. See y'all later.